This one is a bit long overdue, but this is basically Transformers Dark of the Moon Subverse Blackout and Power Glide in the same video. Why in the same video? I want to get over with. I'm a bit disappointed with both of them. It has to do with scaling and a little bit with this transformation being a bit fiddly. Not to mention that I got this two months ago for Christmas, but I haven't reviewed it until now, so I'm thinking, just release it now. Why not? Anyways, uh, we have Blackout, and uh, yes, this is custom painted. It has no uh, Scorponok, because I did not get, get any, I did not get, get this for Versus Scorponok. And I, that basically kind of sucks. I've scaled it with Scorponok, it just, just does not scale well, in truth. It does not. But this guy barely scales well with anyone, and that's kind of sad. Like, really, you, you think he's a big bot, but when you transform him, he's really not. I really do like how they still kept the Decepticon symbol and all that when they painted. They really made him a lot more darker, per se, and I kind of like that, but that's basically it. He does have spinning blades and whatnot. Power Glide is a lot more vibrant. Uh, he does have landing gear, as you can see, and he does have tabbing problems. And, uh, oh yeah, he doesn't come with any weapons, so, uh, take that as what you will. Yeah, he's falling apart, it seems. Like, I tried tabbing him multiple times, but the tabs just, like, don't stick well. Well, it's kind of a sad thing. It's like, these tabs are, like... Yeah. But there you go. And, uh, literally, that's it. So, the comparison was bringing a Legion class just to compare. There you go. Let's bring in a Commander class. You don't have another Commander class transformed. Flip. <sighs> Here it is what it looks like with the Lust class. Uh, let's bring in this guy. I know. I know. Like, I'm just looking a little out, Buster. Uh, bring in Voyager, because why not? Do I even need to bring in a leader? I, I really shouldn't. I really don't. Anyways, transform these two. Uh, first of all, the blades are a little bit difficult, but you basically need to spin them. Like so, and so they get to this position, and then you can bring the blades in from here, like that. And you're gonna basically now you're going to untab this, and it's basically just gonna start unlocking everything. So you're going to untab this, this is going to unlock everything, and you're going to bring these down. These are the these are the legs. These are the legs. Once you split these out and apart, that's it. That is literally the legs, and they're not as tall as you want them to be. Which is this guy is kind of weak in my opinion. He doesn't really sound like a blackout, just more like a minion in truth. Sorry about that. Uh, someone try to come in. So you're gonna bring these like so, and you're just gonna untab it like that. And really, once you have it untabbed, you can flip this whole assembly around like so. Just make sure you have everything flattened out. Once you have it out, then you can bring these like so, and you can bring it around. And then you can just arc it back around like so. And just basically finish realigning the arms. So, and uh, yeah, he has battle blades, but that's really the only good thing he's got going for him. And that's Blackout. He does stand well, though, which I do I do like, but he keeps his, uh, shall we say, uh, uh, concept art feats, which I kind of don't like. 
how to transform him, you're going to split this apart like so. You're going to flip all these back in. You're going to bring this all the way up. And these are just going to tab into here like so. And you're going to have a nightmare with these ones. You really are. Like they don't really tab in at all. You're going to bring this up and over like so. Trace the crotch. Then you're going to flip down the very large feet that he should not have. Like, seriously, if you were to compare this guy, he would be perfect, scaled next to a deluxe, but not for this scale. Like, seriously, dude, you are over, you are too tall. You are way too tall. Anyways, bring out the hands, and flip up the thing. Bring out the hand, flip up the thing. And finally, just flip open the head. That's it. And uh, get ready for insanity. This guy's bigger than Blackout. That's that that that, that is not accurate. All right, that is. I hate that. I hate that. That is not accurate. I will not allow that. At all. Like I I I just refuse. To have that. Why is Blackout smaller? Like, no. He's one of the bigger ones of the films. Not the smaller one. What the heck? Even worse, I compared to Transformers Prime. Which is around the same size as other Dark and the Moon fig Cyberverse figures. This is not accurate. But, 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 like, Megatron. Like, he as is, is at the... That is not accurate. If anything, that's kind of accurate, but at the same time, it's just not. You compare it to this. Oh my god, if I swear Optimus is smaller than the I'm gonna flip. Okay, thank god. No way to the same size. That's even worse. I don't like this at all. I really don't. Now comparing it to the Lux scale, yeah, that actually works. That actually works. Hell. This actually works. But for something like this, no. Something like this, I still gotta review them. No. Something like this, no. Something. Like this. No. I just refuse to think this is Blackout at this point. I think this is my own original character. I, I even refuse to think this is a Power Glide yeah, as well. I'm going to go a little bit of my stories, but this is basically me and my friend Devin as Cybertronians. At this point, that's literally what I'm calling it. Because, like, this is inaccurate. I'm the helicopter, and yes, I love the MH-53. And she's the Warthog, which she does like jets, but I'm not sure she likes that one. But still, the color scheme does work. So, that's kind of why I'm calling it. Also, we got this. Take that as what you will. Just... There's so many things wrong with this. Uh, really, there is. Comparing it to this, because, like, just bringing it with Megatron one more time, so why not? Because, like, just for a spark. Just forget the size. This is inaccurate. All right? This is why I kind of held off, because I knew I was going to be flipping out like this. Articulation goes. No head. Uh, we got... Nothing for the, well, we kind of, we got 360 at the shoulder. We got a, a, a hinge, elbow hinge. We got a elbow swivel, I guess. And we also got the blades, which they do spin, but it's kind of useless. Feet go up and then go back uh, this much. They do the, they, 
They have to do the full splits. Uh, you get 360 knee or thigh rotation, I guess. You got knee rotation up this far, and you got feet rotation. But that's it. And feet uh, flipping out and forth, but that's it. Now, comparing it to... Yeah, you really need to have it as stiff as possible in order to make a stand. All right. Now, for him, no head articulation. Uh... Arms are on 360 shoulder. Uh, ball joint, I guess. Uh, I don't know. Uh, this is definitely on a ball joint. You can go in and out. Left and right, all around. And, uh, yeah, hands are nothing. Waist is nothing. I mean, I really do like how they tried their best when they did with side reverse. Like, I really do. Uh, leg can do the full split. Back that far can kick him in the head. Forward that far, kick you in the face. Knees can bend that far. And there's no feet. So, take that. Really, that's it. So I guess I'll just transform them back and just end the review. Let's start with Blackout slash me. Uh, my my persona's name is Ashes, by the way. So just so you know, uh, I'm gonna flip this out like this, and we're just gonna flip it out all the way back, like so, and just keep that flipped out like that for now. You're gonna bring these up. Honestly, transformation for these guys. Well, besides part of Power Glide. I really do like Blackout's transformation. It's it's intriguing, it's fun, but when it comes to the sizing, die. Honestly, just why? Just why do you even have that? So you're going to flip this up like so. This is going to create like the engine part. You're going to bring all this back. This is going to clip into place kind of and kind of lock into place. I don't know. It should, but it's definitely going to lock in a place when we bring the arms around. And we can keep, got to stop going off camera because uh, this is a new setup, so I'm trying my best. Sorry. There you go. You're going to bring these arms around. You're going to angle them up around. Then you got this tab. You got this tab. You need to slot it in like so. That's going to lock part of the feet in. I'm gonna bring do the exact same thing here. Bring it up and around like so. Clip it in. That's gonna lock everything together. Tab that in, and then you're going to basically reverse transformation here. You're gonna flip that out like so, and then you're going to use this one and just flip it out. And there you go. There's blackout in his vehicle mode and the end of his part of review. Now we're moving on blackout slash ashes. Now moving on to Power Glide slash Magenta. That is uh, Devin's persona. So we're going to split this apart. Bring these up. We're not going to do anything with right now. We're going to bring these down. And we're going to bring them in like so. This is kind of the most fiddly part of transformation. Because you have to fit all of this in. It's kind of a mess. Really. I mean, granted... I really wasn't planning on getting Power Glide, but, uh, I mean, there is some good qualities, I guess. You're going to flip this down, and you're going to make sure the arm is oriented like this, and you're just going to peg, peg it in there like so. If I had weapons, I would gladly show them, but they have none, because I didn't get them with weapons. You're going to flip this down and around. And you're going to flip them out like so. I said flip them out, tab it in the hole. And finally, connect the feet. You got the pack there, you got the hole. Simply put, plug it in, and just try not to disengage, and just... Don't 
There we go. And that's them in the end of review. I don't have a clip for this. I really do not. So I'm sorry if this video is a lot more blander at the beginning than anything. Maybe just take the ranting. I don't know. I Just take the ranting as the clip. I don't know. Anyways, make sure you like, subscribe, comment. And as always, till all are one.